Robotank here. Besieged has been a really awesome game to play. It's simple, small, but just the sandbox it offers is so much fun. Um, and they, they make you really work for it. Like, they don't give you a lot of pre-completed contraptions. You have to figure out all the basics yourself. Even stuff like a, a simple catapult can be difficult. Uh, even something as, as simple as just like steering can take a while to figure out and get a working solution. Now, like anything you try, you can make it work. You can brute force it and figure out something. There's a lot of clever ways to fail at steering. And I found a couple of my favorites. First, I tried steering with a hinge. Um, and it made sense at first. It, it works like essentially like a real car does. Um, it works a little weird because the hinges let you go as far as you want and you can self-destruct your vehicle. And then you can even get like really weird things. <laughs> you can succeed with a lot of weird options. They're not just like good, but you know, it doesn't have to be good. It just has to get there. But one works way better than the others. And that is uh, tank controls. It's a very basic tank steering system. Uh, I think it needs to be at least three, but four works out really well wide. Put wheels front and back, left and right. Uh, having a slightly wider and longer wheelbase will make you more stable, but uh, that's not necessarily the most fun now, is it? And then flip one side, the left side usually, uh, to using left hand, some pair. Either T or G work really well, I and K work well as also. And then you set it down and you have T and G for one side, up and down, still control the other. Use them together to go forwards, backwards, opposites make you spin. And you have a fairly large degree of control. And there you go. That's all there is to it. Do you have your own tips, tricks, tutorials you'd like to see? Let me know in the comments below.